This is Cooper, my Shih Tzu Terrier puppy. Cooper was just 10 weeks old when I got him. He was so small and beautiful and fun to play with all the time. He was my best friend for one day. This is Cooper, one week later. So I'll give you guys a rundown of you know the pros and cons that I've experienced ever since I got a puppy, you know, getting a dog during quarantine. It's no easy work, like it's a lot of fucking work. And you know, if you think that, you know, after hearing my experiences, you think that you're ready to have a dog or a puppy during quarantine, then you know, just do it. Just fucking do it. No one can tell you whether you're ready or not ready to, you know, you know, take on this responsibility. Um, you know, your parents might say no, like clearly my parents said no, I'm Asian. You know, all Asian parents hate dogs, but ever since I brought Cooper home, you know, they've, they've shown him constant love. You know, more love than me. Bam. 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 <laughs> so the first pro about having a dog is that they are your best friend like yeah it's cliche to say but you know dogs will show you constant love no matter what whether you're having a good day whether, whether you're having a bad day another pro of having a dog is that you know it allows you to meet other people and what i mean by that is you know you take your dog to a dog park and a, bun a bunch of people come up to you and they're like oh what kind of dog do you have and you know, I'm usually like, oh, it's a Shih Tzu, it's a Terrier, it's a Corgi. I don't really know, but it creates that conversation that allows you to, you know, meet other people. And now, am I, you know, doing this? Am I going to take my dog to a dog park to, you know, talk to other people? Fuck no, it's a pandemic. But you know, in a normal circumstance, uh, you can, you know, use this opportunity to meet other people. Um, and hell, if you want to, you know, go talk to other people during a pandemic, uh, be my guest. So one of the biggest cons about having a puppy, especially during quarantine or in general, is that you're potty training them at a very young age. So you constantly have to take them out to pee and poop like every hour or else they're gonna shit all over your house and it's gonna smell like, you know, really bad. So that's a, that's a big con. For me personally, I had to wake up every hour uh, throughout the night or like in general I have to go like every hour or two hours to take them out to pee and poop and it's really disruptive especially when you're working from home. Another con is expenses. Now expenses do add up. Uh, when I first got Cooper, uh, the first two weeks I had him, he got worms, like parasites. And I'm like, how? I thought you got deworms, worms but he clearly didn't. And you know, that was a good chunk of money out of my pocket um, when I first got him. So that's two weeks into owning a puppy. I pay for food, snacks. I feed this bitch so many snacks. And like every week I have to go to, you know, the grocery store to get him new snacks because I love giving him snacks. I, I don't know why. He's just such a good boy that I have to give him snacks. So there you guys have it, my pros and cons about having a dog. If you guys want to hear more, just comment below what you guys want to hear. And you know, smash that like button. I don't know why YouTubers are starting to say smash that like button, but you know, drop a like for Cooper. Uh, Cooper, where are you? Where are you? Drop a like for Cooper. <laughs>